Hi, hello, Jana here, yay! I have a new layout for you. It's a Christmas layout and the photo is from the little one and it's um, from 2004 and it was his first Christmas and we spent it in England, in York. And we had a great time and I never scrapped that photo so here I am. And the things I'm using um, are from Pink, Pink Fresh Studio, the Christmas line, uh, Christmas Wishes, I think. And a few bits and bobs from Studio Calico and Seven Paper. And uh, what else? October Afternoon. And Webster's Pages, I think. Oh, and the paper, and one paper from Fracklet Fawn. And I have three um, paper trees, paper Christmas trees I want to use. And um, here I'm adding color to my background. And I started with a glimmer mist from Tattered Angels. Angels? Angels, yes. And um, some Heidi Shine. <laughs> and. Yeah, here you can see the finished background. And now I'm trimming down the photo just a bit and adding. That one is from Freckled. Frecklet Fawn. Near Lawn Fawn. I, I need to look again. Sorry. And a touch of um, green turquoise. And a uh, lot of white and black. And here I decided to stitch two of the three trees to my paper. And the other one in the middle. The middle one I want to pop up with dimension pads. And here I'm grabbing some things from the um, ephemera pack. Die cut pack from the... Pink Fresh Studio Collection. <coughs> Sorry. And I really love the little penguin with the balloons. And now I'm grabbing some flares from Feed Your Craft. Um, the first one said uh, Santa's Little Helper. And I wanted to have uh, a few more on the page, but uh, they didn't make it. Uh, one of them has a red tiny stars on it and the other one is um, oh, a cone. Sugar cone or what? Don't know, sorry. And I grabbed a few more pieces from the um, die cut pack from the Christmas collection, a tree and a present. And I wanted to have the um, label on the layout but no. I didn't. I can't find the right place and so maybe on the next one. And here I'm using pop dots, form pads, dimension pads, whatever you will call them. And now I want I bring in some black and white. That's a tag with stripes on it. And here I'm grabbing another tree. And now some papers, and I think these are from Webster's Pages. And I love the touch of black and white. And I was thinking about uh, to add more red, but um, the photo is red. There are so many red and the little frame and the text on the flare and the little crone from the penguin and I decided against more red. And here I stitch down the um, paper strips to the paper, the border strips, paper strips. 
and I changed the sides for the tag so it's on the left side now And I love that photo it's from the middle one. And he was so tiny, just uh, three months, month old. And so cute. And here I'm looking for the right place, but I will end up on the, yes, on this place spot. And now I'm looking and um, trying out some things, but no, nothing more to add. Just the title and, oh yeah, and I wanted to have some tiny words. And these are from Seven Paper and um, I wanted to have uh, the title First Christmas. And so I grabbed the Daily Flash stickers from October Afternoon and um, added the word first and then I wanted to have a sticker with Christmas or yes Christmas morning or, but there isn't one saying that so I'm looking and reading dun, 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 dun. but no nothing to use here so I'm grabbing um, another set of um, October afternoon alphas in black and edit the word Christmas. First Christmas. Yes. And now, what now, what now? Oh yeah. Then I thought I could use a sticker with family or something like that, but that's, it was too small for my... And I'm stealing that idea with the stars on top of the trees from Missy and thanks for the inspiration <laughs> and now i'm grabbing some animal dots from echo echo park paper and they are from jack and jill some red ones and a light blue one or creamy blue greenish tone and now oh yeah now i wanted um no that one I wanted to have the date on my layout and so I grabbed the date stamp from Schimmel but um, it's only um, back to 2009 so I needed to grab the alphas again adding the date or just the year and I am done and I totally love how this turned out here a little close up and thank you so much for watching and see you next time. Bye.